BBC News at midday. The Russian military says there are no survivors after one of its planes crashed in the Belgorod region. Moscow says 65 prisoners of war were on board the aircraft. The group were reportedly due to be part of a prisoner swap. The defence ministry in Kiev said it's trying to clarify what has happened. The Federation of Small Businesses has warned that a reduction in the number of days that Royal Mail delivers posts could cause real disruption to the economy. The regulator, Ofcom, has suggested reducing letter services from six days a week to five or three. Senior Conservatives have rallied round the Prime Minister after the former Cabinet Minister, Sir Simon Clark, said Rishi Sunak should be replaced as Tory leader. The Home Secretary, James Cleverly, said it would be foolish to have further dissent within the party. An international team of scientists has successfully implanted an embryo into a southern white rhino for the first time. The hope is the technique can be used to save its technically extinct close cousin, the northern white rhino. That's the BBC News. Now the shipping forecast issued by the Met Office on behalf of the Maritime and Coast Guard Agency, a double one three zero on Wednesday the 24th of January. There are warnings of gales in Viking, North at Sierra, South at Sierra, Forties, Cromarty, Forth, Tyne, Dogger, Fisher... German Bight, Humber, Thames, Rockall, Bailey, Fair Isle, Faroes, and South East Iceland. The general synopsis at 0600, low Norwegian basin 972, losing its identity. The area forecasts for the next 24 hours. Viking, northwest, gale 8 to storm 10, backing southwest 3 to 5, showers, good occasionally poor. North at Sierra, south at Sierra, 40s, Cromarty. Westerly 5 to 7 at first in North at Sierra. Otherwise, northwesterly 7 to severe gale 9, backing southwesterly 3 to 5, then southerly 4 to 6 in 40s and Cromarty. Showers, rain later in Cromarty, good occasionally moderate. Fourth, Tyne, Dogger, Fisher, Germanbite, Humber. West or northwest 6 to gale 8, occasionally severe gale 9, except in Fourth and Tyne, backing southwest 3 to 5 then south 4 to 6, except in Fisher and German Bight. Showers, rain later, good, occasionally poor. Thames, Dover, Weiss. South or southwest, 5 or 6, but 7 or gale 8 at first in Thames, decreasing 3 to 5. Rain, good, occasionally poor. Portland, Plymouth, North Biscay. Southwesterly, 3 to 5, occasionally 6 later in Plymouth. Rain, good, occasionally poor. South Biscay, South East Fitzroy. Variable 2 to 4, becoming southwesterly 3 to 5. Rain, good, occasionally poor. Northwest Fitzroy, Seoul. Southwesterly 4 to 6, occasionally 7 in west. Rain, good, occasionally poor. Lundy, Fastness. Southwest, backing southeast 3 to 5, veering southwest 5 or 6. Rain, fog patches, moderate to very poor. Irish Sea, Shannon. South or southwest, four to six, occasionally seven in Shannon. Rain, good, occasionally poor. Rockall, Malin, Hebrides, Bailey. West or southwest, five to seven, backing south, six to gale eight later in Rockall, and seven to severe gale nine in Bailey. Rain, good, occasionally poor. Fair Isle, Faroes, northwest, seven to severe gale nine, backing southwest, four to six, then south, five to seven. Showers, good, occasionally poor. South East Iceland, south westerly 4 to 6, backing southerly 7 to severe gale 9. Showers, good, occasionally poor. And that completes the shipping forecast here on BBC Radio 4 Longwave. From the 1st of April this year, Radio 4 will stop running a separate Longwave schedule. The shipping forecast, produced by the Met Office on behalf of the Maritime and Coast Guard Agency, will continue, as it always has done, to be broadcast on other channels, including by HM Coast Guard and on BBC Radio 4, FM and DAB. If you are unable to receive DAB at your location, please search for bbc.co.uk slash reception and click on radio on television.